This next topic is uh, front yard terrorism. Um, for what we did, and I'm not sure if Joe ever got in on this, is uh, any car that ran by, um, we would very innocently but very frantically scream hi at them. Any car would come back, we'd be like, hi, hi, hello. And then one of us would run after the car and then fall down <laughs> in the side yard. Um, they, Mom and Dad let this go on for a long while until they actually realized we were having fun, I think. And then they squashed it. But um, did anyone ever stop? Oh, yeah. And people never really approved, never no. appreciated it. Uh, a couple variations on that. Um, in second grade, uh, we had... There was a bus stop, you know, 30 feet away mm -hmm. from our house. And I remember one morning, maybe one of many mornings, Joe and I would stick our tongues out at cars passing by. Mm -hmm. And one morning, it was my second grade teacher coming down the road. Mm -hmm. And we were sticking their tongues out and, you know, which at the time was, you know, equal to... The finger or something Probably. like that. Yeah. And she drove by. Miss Jamellis drove I remember by. Miss Jamellis. Uh, and saw us. And we all made eye contact, but she just kept driving. I think it was processing for her and us. And Jill and I looked at each other. I was just, because she was my second grade teacher, not Jill's. They kept us separated all throughout elementary school because mm -hmm. they had two teachers for every grade. Um, I you know, got in and was questioned about it. Why are you doing that? And I, I never understood, but we had, through the years, different variations on it. Um, I remember once playing across the street. I forget who it was. Uh, this is sixth or sixth grade or junior high mischief of, like, throwing a Frisbee back and forth over the street and throwing it right in front of cars as <laughs> they would pass. We used to throw crab apples at cars. Do you remember that? Yeah. We also used to throw... <laughs> <laughs> Straight up rocks at cars. Well, we didn't throw them at cars. We threw them across the street. And one happened <laughs> to hit a car. And the guy slowly backed up as we walked away. And uh, you sort of let me take the fall on that one. <laughs> and I got a very, very stern lecture, which didn't really make any sense. He said, what if that would have hit me and knocked me out? I see, I don't remember great. the conversation. I blanked that out. It was yeah. a white Cadillac, though, I remember. Was, yeah, with rust all all around. We did smoke it pretty well. Well, I wasn't trying to. <laughs> and he said, what's your name? Where do you live? We told him nothing. I remember we told him nothing. Right. That's one thing we did. So, Francis Road was really never safe from <laughs> 1990 until about 2000.